We're broadcasting from B&B Spank Stadium in Baltimore, Scaryland. There's some history behind this team, Bricks. 23 years ago, the original Cleveland Burns snuck out of Cleveland, leaving their fans heartbroken. They relocated to Baltimore and renamed themselves the Razors. Well, if they were based in Cleveland, Grim, I can completely understand the move. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team stormed the field. The San Francisco 49 Nightmares battle, the Baltimore Razors. Won the goat toss and can choose to kick off or receive. They choose to receive. Hi, this is Grim Blitzrow, and welcome to the Mutant Football League. We'll be right back for kickoff, but first, let's listen in on the pregame speech. Hello again, everybody. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. That's me. And his mutant hobbit head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. How about you shut the fuck up? Well played, Jr. Moving on. It's almost time for kickoff, and I could not be more thrilled. I know you won't stop squeezing my shoulder. Sorry, Briggs. It's uh, just so exciting. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Crusher right there, folks. Second down in a very lot. He's not going down. point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Pacow, what a kick. That's headed for the end zone. Pacow? And just throwing some stuff at the wall to see what sticks, Bricks. Crushed! Second down and five. Hot one, hot two, hot Falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Ah, uh, thank you. I do my part. Third down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him.
boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Seven yards right there. Second and three. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two. And we're at the two-minute warning, folks. Stay tuned for the halftime show. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Hey, the dog thing snags. He got hit by a car and died. I just saw that story. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And he scores! That's six points for a special teams unit on a fantastic punt return. And for those of you that had him on your fantasy team, congratulations. Any mistakes here? Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Yeah, that was not a kick you put on the resume. That's the kind of kick that starts world wars. for the jugular and rushes to kill the court. <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Wow, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay it for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Second down in a mile. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost ejection. Close your eyes, Brick. This is going to get ugly fast. Oh, good run. He nearly broke it open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly blew three times. So At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football teams are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Except for when they're lopsided. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Man, he just kicked the living shit out of that ball. Exactly. I thought that after shit game, you couldn't inflate your balls with shit no more. Yeah, he don't care. This guy's been a shit baller since he came into the league. suburban mom on the way to speak to the manager and he sure got me like a monkey trying to buck a grease foot ouch what is this 80s wrestling the coach isn't liking that call 
His head just exploded. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First and ten. Oh. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponent. I want to take a He's leaving it all out on the field today. Now there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's his gallbladder. Wow, my bad. Shave a few days off his life. Hey, little man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. The 10! Touchdown! Yeah, you know, it should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's a fake kick! Well, that two-point conversion attempt failed miserably. I mean, that was just terrible. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry up offense, you moron. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. See that little baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> For six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, 
Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defender. That's a first down. And that'll bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. down and six. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. He's on, if he was still talking, he'd be saying, Psycho Killer Keska Say. What the fuck, 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 fuck. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. The defense is on its heels. Great run on that play. And with one timeout remaining, the defense has to get something going here. Third down and, well, good luck. And he snags it for six! Touchdown! Touchdown! point attempt. A fake kick? This is going to ruin my fake team's fake... And that's a good by the numbers throw. And those numbers add up to two. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And this guy is one of the best. 
Both shit kickers in the lead. And it's first and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, oh, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry? Oh, it's a punishing hit. <laughs> Second down and a lot. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off-season. He could go all the way. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know what's... Look out! They try to catch the defense napping and fake the... That's a beautiful pass for the conversion! Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you music out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And Baltimore escapes this brouhaha with an impressive win. Folks, this wasn't even close. It was a total shellacking, like watching a knife cut through butter. More like an axe through butter, Grim. More like a chainsaw through baby shit, because that pretty much describes what we just saw. And the MVP of today's game is just about to speak. As soon as he gets his jaw back in place. Nope, oh, there he's got yeah, it now. Yeah. Yep. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy. What? What? What?